Oh, sh**. What time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose. Hello. Hey, I've got food in my mouth. Want to eat it out of me like a bird? Okay. Mmm, <laughs> yummy. Mm. Hey, so last video we were talking about Rayman. Uh, yeah, and I remembered the Rayman games I played. So yeah. I played... Um, Elliot took a breather from shooting all the tentacle guys and... Open that in a sec. Yeah, I played um Rayman, the original Rayman Legends, or no. Rayman um, 2, The Great Escape. Yeah, yeah, but which what's is what the we third want. one? Uh, Rayman 3 Hoodlum Havoc for no, the no, GameCube. No, 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 I played... Um, Rayman Origins. Yeah, that's a fun one. But yes, Rayman 2 Great Escape, that's my favorite one. So what we were talking about was Elliot wanted to talk about the Cave of Bad Dreams. Dude, I, I didn't want to get farther in the game like I did. And I get to that spot and I'm like, no. This is fucking scary. Mm -hmm. So so yeah, like, so here's my story with that because I totally relate to you on that. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Oh, great. And I think I did just get the charge shot. Yep. Swear. Wow, I'm surprised I fucking remember all this shit. The friggin' Nazis who design, designed this area, they're very clever. Yeah, they are. You know, just to clarify, I, I'm not talking about the actual game developers. I'm talking, you know, I'm not going to use the word Nazi anymore in case somebody just clicks on this video for the first time and they're like, you're, That's insul fair. you're insulting the people at Nintendo calling them Nazis? No. Uh, I'm talking for, about the For characters. this last reference, I guess it was in reference to an episode or two ago when we yes, got the missiles. Yes. Uh, All right, but but anyway, we don't we don't actually think they're Nazis. <laughs> no, I love Nintendo. I love them like family. Yeah, fuck even Nazis. though I've I've never met them. So um yeah, so, we talk. So yeah, Rayman Two. I, I loved that game as a kid. I I ended up getting a strategy guide for it before I even got halfway through the game, and I ended up skipping ahead to read about oh, the later shit. levels. Okay. I, and I saw <laughs> that's shitty. That's like. I, well, okay, I guess if you're a kid, that makes sense. Like, yeah, it's whatever. I, I would never do that today. But Yeah. Uh, but so then I saw there's a level called the Cave of Bad Dreams, mm. and I saw that it had this creepy... The Cave of Butt Plugs. The freaking Mike Wazowski monster guy, before Monsters, Inc. even came out. I don't out, even remember what he looked like. He's, he, yeah, he's... he's uh, just imagine Mike Wazowski with the big eye. Mm -hmm. He's green, except he has sharp teeth, and he has, like, a purple hat and a cane. Okay. He's, like, all... Mm -hmm. So... I read about it, and I read that there's a part near the end of the level where you have to fight him, and the camera view is inside his mouth. <gasps> so you see, you're you're looking at Rayman through his his mouth and his jaws and teeth, and you're like, oh god, you're gonna fucking eat me! Ah! So that terrified me as a kid, and I was like, oh. Was he bigger than Mike Wazowski? Or oh, he's yes, he's bigger than Mike Mike Wazowski. Okay. <laughs> Obviously. Mike Wazowski. He's like way bigger. Than I haven't Rayman, seen that movie obvious. in forever. That's a good movie. That that, that was a good movie. Monsters Incorporated, for all you scrubs who don't know what it is. <laughs> if Alien knows a movie, then... Oh, dude, I just saw Samus's face. Yeah, collection. that's what I'm... Okay, so there's so much, like, attention to detail in this game. Here, let me go into the light. So if I just fire this for a little while, you should be able to see, like, steam heat waves coming off of my gun. Do you see that? I do see that. And... Nice. If you're, like, you can get a reflection off of a really bright light. Oh, you I saw see it. Your eyeballs. Yeah, I saw it. Like, that's crazy. Blink, blink. They I just... saw her eyelashes. Yeah, it's really awesome. I mean, I feel like they do this shit in games now, too. It's just... At the back time. then, it was just like, damn! Oh, yeah, okay, dude. I need to get the, the bombs for this. I don't remember where they are. So we can't progress higher up in here for now. Hmm. Um, all right. So we have the morph ball, and we have the... We what can it, go what explore it, this way. We have the charge shot now, so does that yeah. mean there are some doors we can open now that we pass by? I don't think there are by? any that, like, require the charge shot that I... Oh, hey. Is oh, it? right, it's another one of these fucking things. Oh, great. <laughs> Wait, I wonder if it persists. Fun, fun. Oh, oh yeah, so, it, but it was back to the Rayman thing. Uh, oh, yeah, sorry. So, yeah, that terrified me, and I was like, oh, God, hell no, 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 hell no, 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 I ain't going to this barbecue. You can only invite my ass like I'm a vegan, and you're only serving me. But eventually, it got to the point where I was like, okay, you know what? I really want to play through the game. I'm just gonna do it. I'm gonna bravely fight through it. It was one of the first things in my life that I knowingly fought through my fear on. <laughs> so, once I got to the Cave of Bad Dreams, you know, the boss, his name is Jano, I think. Okay. The Guardian, Mike Wazowski thing. <laughs> he's actually there, and he's kind of creepy. He's like, I'll let you in. I'll give you a head start to the treasure, but I will show you no mercy. And I'm like, oh god, he's talking about the teeth chase part. <laughs> So I fought through it, and it wasn't as scary once I when I actually did it. So, ah. but you on the other hand, Elliot? Oh, I was like, what the fuck? 
this is shit. I remember, like, I think I had, like, my <laughs> friends over, too, and we were just, like, screaming the whole time, like, you were. Ah! Oh, that's, yeah. uh-oh, spaghetti we fucking piss scared. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, if I didn't read the strategy guide ahead of time, I would have pissed my pants. Just I'm like gonna you. pee my pants. You're gonna pee my pants. We're gonna share my pants. It's gonna be pretty nasty. Don't go in there. Uh, I'm just trying to get through. But yeah, so yeah, the, but then once I got past that, I was like, all right, you know what? This part's not that scary. No. So yeah, no. That was like my passage into manhood. <laughs> when I was like seven years old. <laughs> and meanwhile, like in some fucking cultures, they like make you trip balls on like fucking ayahuasca and things like that and then, make you have to go kill a mountain lion or yeah, something, something that's like that. we're like i played fucking rayman origin or rayman fucking two and <laughs> beat the spook level <laughs> the burn dome burn dome okay so we want to go here yeah. gathering hall wait fuck my ass off you gotta be fucking kidding me what god damn it what oh, we gotta go back oh, Some to, bitch. The, to the tall tower area yeah. At least we didn't get too far. Didn't you say like we need, we couldn't go up to that part yet? Yeah, I guess there's a different place we need to go. It's yeah, yeah. Yes, we'll see. We'll see if this is correct. That's one thing I like about this game. After a while, it's just like, hey, hey, you fucking idiot, you're going the wrong way. Figure okay. out a way to get here, and you're like, okay. Yeah, I'm I'm way more tolerant to that nowadays. As a kid, I was not at all. I was. I was oh, just you didn't have... want it to tell you what to do? Well, well, no, like, I was, like, I didn't like having to figure out where to go, where it's oh. like, because, like, playing frickin' Ocarina of Time, like I said, I would usually get stuck on a part in the dungeon, and I'd have to, and I'd be like, what do I do? Ah. I don't like games that really handhold, but this game is not that bad, like, it's, it's pretty balanced. It's pretty bad, like, it took a while to show up, and it just shows me, like, that we, we have the map, because I got a map, but mm. normally you're just, like, you just see this part, and you're like, how do I get there? And you'd have to figure out, like, well, this is kind of close. Maybe I could take a door to, like, take a passage here. You know? Okay. Oakley, dokley. Oakley, dokley, Let's see. So, you, we talked a little bit about, like, games that you got scared about in the past. Oh, wait, no. You, oh, you, you were talking about Rayman Origins earlier, right? Oh, yeah. That's a fun game and fun multiplayer game. Yeah, dude. I, I, see, here's the thing. I think Jen would like it. I want to, I think I'll buy that today on PS4. Oh, I have it. Ooh, nice. I have it on uh, Xbox 360. On a disc or? On a disc. Oh, shit. Yeah, dude. We can play that sometime if you want. Ooh, I also wow. have Rayman Legends for the Wii U, which is the best version, by the way. Because, Why? Because, uh, well. Wii U? What is that shit? Well, Wii U, well the Wii U. Oh, actually, they, they did make a definitive vision, version for the Switch recently. But no, the, the Wii U version is the best because Rayman Legends, it, uh, they, they first, uh, they designed the game around the Wii U gamepad. Oh. And, uh, like, there's, like, this method where, like, a fifth or fourth player can come in when everybody else is playing on screen, and uh -huh. you can tap. You know how, oh, remember New right. Super Mario Brothers? U? Yep. It's just like that. But, it, and it's actually super badass. But, uh, like, you still do it in the other console versions, but you, you have nothing to tap. So you just use tap another that. controller. It, it's hard tap to explain, but I'll, I'll, I'll show you later. But, um, yeah, Rayman Origins, dude. I, I was a huge Rayman fan for the longest time. Yeah. Oh, wow. See, okay, so real quick here. Yeah. Um, yeah, you're, you're totally right in this. Oh, yeah, by the way, see how I attracted those with the power shot? I'm right? Yeah. What am I right about? I was going to say this game isn't really like a huge FPS-focused game. It's, it's more Ooh, of that I adventure. saw some eyes there. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, eyes. Oh, pretty. That's what I play the game for. Oh, eyes. I don't have any beautiful. eyes, so I like to look at them. <laughs> um... Yeah, dude, d this game it is very adventuring. Speaking of Monsters, Inc. I'm watching you, Wazowski. <laughs> Always What's her watching. Name? Oz? Roz. Roz? Roz? Yeah. <laughs> Roz, the great and powerful. <laughs> I am Roz! The Wizard of Roz. The Wizard of Roz. <laughs> hey, Mike Wazowski. Don't, don't forget your paperwork, otherwise, I'll send my flying monkeys after you, and they're gonna <laughs> fuck your shit up, Wazowski. Yeah. <laughs> Um, now listen, I'm gonna take a cigarette break, and if that shit's not filled out by the time I get back, I'm gonna <laughs> make you look like a horse's ass. Yeah, she does. She does kind of sound like a s smoker. She does have that smoker voice, I guess. That uh, that is the extent of the, that voice. I'm gonna do my voice. My uh, throat is like, fuck you, dick. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, you know, so for several. Oh my god. For after Rayman Three, Hoodlum Havoc came out on on the Cube. On the Cube. In like 2003, I think. Yeah. I that was the last true Rayman game for a long time and 
so then Raving Rabbits came out a few years later, but everyone was like, what? It's not an adventure game, it's a party game, what the hell? Red. And then finally in 2011 came uh, mm. Rayman Origins, and that was a big deal for me, because it's like, oh, it's it's a reboot. It was basically a reboot of the series mm. with kind of a, with a new style, because like in the older games, Rayman himself, he's like a bit more serious. Like, I gotta save the Glade of Dreams. Come on, Lee, tell me what I need to do. Let's do this. Mm -hmm. But then in Rayman Origins, it's like, Hey, what's up? <laughs> I'm gonna slap you, Glowbox. <laughs> so th that was kind of off-putting at first, so... Oh, this motherfucker! Oh. Yes, yeah. I remember these guys. Stone Toad. That was it. Whoa. Uh... Barf me! All right. What oh, wait, the... I can't use him yet. I think you have to have the bomb. You let him eat you, and then you bomb him, and then he, like, spits you out really far, I think. Or maybe you just kill him that way. I don't remember. <laughs> I see. Oh, but so what I was going to say is that's why I like Rayman Legends better, because by the time... Because Legends came out, like, two years later. Mm -hmm. Two or three years later. And by that point, I was used to the new style. Okay. So, yeah, <gasps> That's why I like it better. <gasps> Ooh, honeycombs. <gasps> Next time on this game, we're gonna fucking fight this boss! <laughs>